Hello friends, welcome to Freshers Now YouTube channel. Today we are going to know about how to fill JK SSP JE online application form 2022. To register, you have to open your Google tab and then search for how to fill JK SSP JE online application form. 2022 fresher snow and then click on enter here you can see our website so click on the first link and here you have to scroll down here you can see that for JK SSP JE apply online link so click here here you can see the latest openings and here you can read the job name and then click on apply. If you are already a registered member you can log in otherwise you have to click on sign up. Here you have to give your personal details. First of all enter your first name and select your gender if you are male, female or transgender and enter your email address. and retype your email address and then enter your mobile number and retype your mobile number and click on register an OTP was sent to your registered mobile number so check it and enter the OTP and enter the password of your choice and reconfirm the password and then click on submit OTP. Registration done successfully and here you have to log in. So enter your mail ID and password and click on I am not a robot and click on login you have successfully login so you have to click on apply here you have to select the post you want to apply for junior engineer civil or junior engineer mechanical so click on the option and then click on save and continue here you have to click on your post junior engineer mechanical and then click on item number UT202 and then click on save and continue here enter your order of preference so enter one and click on save and continue and here you have to enter your personal details your name and gender is already given in registration form enter your father's name and your mother's name and select your gender and then select your category means your caste and then select that you are a government employee or not and then select your date of birth and then select whether you are married or not and then enter domicile certificate number of Jammu and Kashmir and enter the and enter the authority name who issued the certificate and then select whether you are related to Jammu or Kashmir and then select your district and then click on save and continue and here you have to enter your address details and then your locality and then your city and then your division and then select your district and then select your tehsil and then enter your area pin code 
and then click on save and continue. Click on yes if your correspondent address is same as permanent address and scroll down and here you have to click on save and continue and here you have to enter your category details. Select your date of issued certificate and the other day of issuing that certificate and select whether you are a physically challenged person or not and then select whether you are an employee of Jammu and Kashmir government if yes means you can click on yes or else you can click on no are you an ex-serviceman and then click on save and continue here you have to select whether any illegal records has been issued on you or not whether any FIR has been registered against you and any prosecution is pending in any court of law whether any charge sheet has been filed against you like that if it is yes means you can click on yes or else you can click on no and then click on save and continue and here you have to enter your educational details select your board of examination and then enter your 10th class percentage and then enter your pass date of your 10th class and enter your obtained marks of 10th class and then enter the maximum marks of 10th class here you have to select your intermediate board of examination and then enter your intermediate percentage and then select your result date of intermediate and then enter your obtained marks and then maximum marks of intermediate do you have degree from any recognized university if yes means you can click on yes or else you can click on no if yes means you have to give your university details and select your degree name and enter your university and then enter your degree percentage and then select your degree result date and enter the marks you obtained in degree and the maximum marks of degree and then select do you have diploma or not and then click on save and continue here you have to select that your educational qualifications is as per the notification or not and then choose your examination center and then click on save and continue here you have to declare that you have read all the instructions and rules carefully and click on I agree and then click on save and continue here you have to upload your photograph and signature to upload your photograph click on browse and select your photograph and then you have to upload your signature so click on browse and select your signature and then click on save and continue here is your application scroll down and review your details carefully and click on the option and then click on proceed to payment and here you have to enter your card details and then click on make payment when you make the payment successfully then only your application will be considered as a valid application otherwise it will be rejected so that's it friends i hope you understood the process of jk ssp je online application form registration process 2022 thank you friends